quiz channels are a great way to start a YouTube channel in 2023, as they can garner millions of views and generate a substantial passive income. Let's take a look at this YouTube channel. While the channel isn't very old, it has managed to amass a good number of subscribers with just 76 videos. If we check out their content, we can see that it is quite eye-catching, and the addition of sound effects makes it even more engaging. In today's video, I will show you how to create similar videos and how to grow on YouTube. So, let's dive right into it. First, we need to go to ChatGPT and enter the following prompt. You can choose how many questions you want to generate. I will generate 10 questions. Now that we have the questions and answers ready, we should proceed to Canva and log in yourself. Then, click on the Create a Design option. Next, look for the Video option and select it. After the blank canvas loads, click on the apps icon located on the left-hand side. Then, select the Videos option. Here, search for a blue background video and choose the one that appeals to you the most. For me, I'm going with this one. Next, let's add a text box for our question. Go back to ChatGPT and copy the question and paste it in the text box. Then, format the text to your liking based on your preferences. Then, click on the Elements tab and search for Circle. Click on it to add it to your canvas, then change the colour to black and make a copy of that circle. Now, place both the circles in the following way. Make the second circle a bit smaller. Then add border to the bigger circle in the following way. Now, let's proceed to add images of the monuments. To do this, once again, click on the apps icon on the left-hand side and select the photos option. Here, search for each monument mentioned by ChatGPT. For instance, let's start with the Colosseum. You'll find images available. Simply right-click on the one you prefer, then click on Add to Folder and create a new folder for these images. Repeat this process for all the monuments and place them within the same folder. Afterward, click on the Elements option on the left-hand side and look for a rectangle frame. Choose one of the frames available. Then, access the Projects option on the left and select the Images folder you created. Drag one of the images into the frame you selected earlier. Now, from the Elements tab, search for a rectangle and add it to the canvas. Then, format the rectangle as follows. Next, duplicate the rectangle three times. You can do this by using the Ctrl plus C and Ctrl plus V buttons on the keyboard. Arrange them in the following order. Change the color of the last rectangle to yellow, since it's our answer box. Next, we need a five second timer. Unfortunately, the five second timer isn't available on Canva. No worries though, I'll share the timer on our Telegram channel so you can download it from there. I've already uploaded the timer on Canva and I'll drag and drop it onto the canvas. Then click on Edit Video option and remove the background, then click on the scissors icon to make it exactly 5 seconds. Remember to mute the timer. Now I'll swiftly add the numbers and options. Next, let's add animation to each element as follows. We need to adjust the timing of each element. Actually, we only need to change the timings of two elements, the timer and the answer. Let's see how. Right-click on the timer element and select Show Timing, set the pointer to 3 seconds. Start the timer from there and stop it after 5 seconds. Now, right-click on the answer element, choose Show Timings and display it where the timer ends. One more thing left, sound effects. No worries, Canva provides them. Click on the apps icon, select the audio option. Search for cork, Choose the first one and adjust it from where the image pops. Then find Egg Timer, add the first audio, adjust it from when the timer starts to when it stops. In the audio section, search for Logo Ascend, 
select the first audio and adjust it from where the answer pops. Then select all the elements on the screen, hit the delete key on your keyboard. Download the canvas with audio. Now upload this downloaded file to Canva. Undo the elements using Ctrl plus Z on your keyboard to restore them. Replace the background with the video we just downloaded and remove these sound effects as the uploaded video already has them. Here comes the crucial step. Click on the apps icon, choose Bulk Create and click Edit Data Manually. Clear the table and copy the complete table from ChatGPT. Paste it here and delete the monument column by right-clicking on it. Click Add Image, then click the plus icon in the image column. Select the respective image for each row, then hit Done. Right-click on the number element and select Connect Data and select the number column. Do the same for the image, options and answer elements. You'll see a tick mark in front of each element. Click Continue and then hit Generate Pages. Your complete quiz video is ready. Let's play it. The video already looks great, but here's an additional suggestion. You can add a voice speaking out the answer at the end. To do this, go to Eleven Labs, sign in, enter the answer, for example Italy, hit Generate, download the audio file, and upload it to Canva. Add it where the answer pops, repeat this for each slide, and your quiz video is ready. If you want me to share this completed Canva template and the table generation prompt, just comment below and I'll share it with you all. Thank you for your support. I'll see you in the next one.